What's going on guys, welcome to Sonic Sounds and today we are going to talk about Spread by DJ Swivel. If you haven't heard of DJ Swivel, he's an international name, worked with some of the biggest artists. He recently started releasing plugins and this is a second plugin that he released. The first one was for vocals, now this is a stereo spread plugin. It was on sale for 15 bucks, normal price 99 bucks. And as soon as I slapped it on a track, I really liked the results. So I wanted to share it with everyone here and see how it can help your production and your sound. So let's jump into it. We'll go through the interface and see what kind of difference it makes to the overall track. Once you load the plugin, it's super simple. You have this big knob that you can turn to increase or decrease the width. And then you have an option to kind of tell the plugin how much you want that particular signal for low, mids, and highs to get spread out. And right over here, you have your crossover free frequencies where the purple is the low, the blue is the mid, and the green is the highs. You can move these knobs around and it will impact it relatively right up here. You can also use your scroll wheel and move these in and out. And then if you move the knob in the middle, it pretty much spreads the whole track up. It looks like it's a low cut filter and pretty much you can move it right to the left. It goes from 5 hertz to 200 hertz. I would just probably leave it at 200. I don't really want it impacting my low end frequencies as much. And again, at the bottom, you have a tilt here as well. So you can move the sound right to the left. So let's listen to the track and then we'll enable the plugin and mess with some settings and see what kind of things it can do and the results we can get from it. So this is the track without spread enabled. So you can see there's a lot going on. There are a bunch of melodic elements as well as drums, percussion, effects, record scratches, all kinds of things going on. So let's play it and then I'm going to enable the plugin halfway through. It is doing some magic to the track and specifically those high frequencies and specifically the high pitched instrument that's called tumbi. It's really spreading that thing apart to the right and left ear. And I can just imagine if there were some vocals in here, it would do some amazing magic to those as well. So let's go through the plugin and see what it does. So it looks like you have a solo for the high frequency. So let's just do that and play it. I would normally just spread out the, the high end all the way. Now these are the mids. And then you also have the low frequency. Now you have to keep in mind, if this is all the way to the right, anything under 200 is not getting impacted anyways. And if you don't want anything in the low frequency, let's say below 500 to come in, I'm assuming you can just press the X and it won't get impacted. So this is your solo and this is your mute button. So that was a walkthrough of Spread by DJ Swivel. As you can tell by my facial expressions, I was really liking what the plugin was doing. It was giving the track a lot of movement, even though the track was already nicely mixed and there were things in place already. There was panning, EQ, but adding this plugin and adding a bit of stereo spread was just adding life and injecting life into the track. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment below. I'll also be doing another tutorial on stereo width in all of your tracks. So make sure you're subscribed for that. And I'm also doing a microphone giveaway in the next couple of weeks. So make sure you subscribe, tell your friends about it, and I will see you at the next one.